my god, the tires on this bike are massive, dude. We're going over fucking IEDs and shit. Yeah, We're in the streets of Afghanistan. Chill, dude. I know, dude. I claim my Everest this bitch. It's thicker than my. What's up, guys? About to head to Memo's house. We're gonna do some car work today. We're working on his girl's sister's car. We're putting new uh, new rotors and new brake pads in the car because you know, as you know, the braking system in a car is the most important if you don't want to fucking die. So we'll catch you guys there. Let's take this fucking tool. What's up, dude? What's up, bro? Oh, she found it. All right, so this is the car that we're gonna be working on today. It's a Toyota Matrix. Um, the rotors and brake pads are right here. So, shouldn't be a tough job. There you is the e-brake on? I don't know, is it? Dude, look at those arms, dude. Look at those doing? fucking arms. What? Oh, it's a front wheel drive car. I was decides to uh, loosen up the rear brakes. I mean, not the rear brakes, but he acted like he was in a rear. He was unaware. Um, I was unaware of the procedure. Did you loosen the brakes? Uh, what? What? The main unit? My fucking hand? Savage in this fucking place. Dude, Tito has this, dude. We should have brought the compressor. You have it? You fucking ass head? What is the pit stop? I'll show you my pit stop. Let's go, Alex. Yeah. No, on the other side. You don't remember? No, I don't remember. Ah! Yeah, so I'm gonna organize your tools when I say control. You have to promise me. Cross your heart that you're gonna put them right back where they come from. Holy shit. What happened? They like melted on the brake. Oh Dude, you have like 116. I don't know how you're still here. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Does the deal charge a fire? Oh, bigger. Bigger? Bigger. bigger. Always bigger, bro. Bigger is always better. Yeah. Sure. It's a rule of thumb. It fucking worked! It uh, fucking worked! Yeah, I'm gonna have to hammer it out. Hmm. Safety. Stuck on there, dude. This shit's broken. It's not broken, it's fucking gone, bud. It's not a fucking ratchet, Alex. You can't just fucking. Mm. Guys, if you guys are ever having trouble of getting a stuck rotor, just fucking take the fuck out of it. There you go. There you go. Look, you see that? It just comes. To oh, no, it's up. It's up. That's Boom! This is, we've been struggling with this for 15 minutes trying to be babies with this fucking rotor. We have to... brand new rotors right here, bud. We have brand new rotors right here, bud. We're fucking here. <laughs> Jesus fucking safety. I know, but look. Okay, you said the fucking. You didn't ever said the extension, you dumbass. I didn't. I said the bit. Of fuck. <laughs> <laughs> fuck up, bitch. We got the Hulk brakes. So wait, bright. These are fucking military surplus brakes. These actually, they're, they're tank brakes, actually. 1967. Hold on, bro. These don't fit. They do fit. How? They don't fit. Oh shit! Fucking ass, that dogs. <laughs> All right, so what Memo's using right now is this thing called, what is it, brake, like, brake noise glue? It's called, uh, this, this brake, brake quiet. Do you rub it around every night, Memo? <laughs> Bro, I rub this shit around all the time. Oh, what the fuck are you doing, bud? How dare you mow your lawn in the middle of our fucking video? No respect. C-clamp, so what we're gonna do... God fucking damn it. All right, so we moved uh, away from the lawnmower. Cause I need to check the handicap on, on the brake fluid level. So you see, like, the fluid's gonna go up, Oh, All right, so we just worked on the piston on that side. So as you can see now, the brake fluid level is a lot higher than what it is. So this is why you want to keep a 
um, a good eye on it because you know if she had too much it would be overflowing right now but luckily she has like the perfect amount once we uh, install them and then like squish the brakes on the inside like the actual brake pedal it'll drop down to its normal level and she should be good to go there you, oh. go. there you go. All right, guys, what's up? We are here where we fucking always are. LA Fitness. It's like 8.30 p.m., so it's pretty fucking packed. But uh, Memo's hitting chest. I already came earlier today, but I don't have shit to do right now. So I'm backing Memo up. Uh, he's gonna hit chest, I'm gonna hit some tries, and then we're gonna head back to his place after. So we'll make a nice little edit for you guys right now. Prestos, you know, no big deal. Team No Cavs. You guys are Team No Cavs. Give us a like, comment. Fuck with Team No Cavs. Alex, what do you have to say to the camera? I just want to tell. I'm gonna say out of my mom. I want to say hi to your mom, too. Who's? Yours. <laughs> So what's going on right now? I've been waiting for a fucking bench for about 10 minutes now. I have to come in at 8 o'clock on Monday and do chest day. Rule of thumb, just don't do chest day on Monday. It's like international, international yeah. chest day. Just don't do that. Alright, we're on to the next machine. It's kind of a, a butt plug today at the gym just because it's so packed. Uh, so we haven't been able to get any machines like too fast. It's a little bit unmotivating, a little bit discouraging. So the most slept on thing that people like don't realize is vital for triceps is like the pull down, the, the, the tricep pull down, and like all variations of it. So obviously you have the ropes. Uh, if I attach this piece right here, I'd be able to do the, you know, the regular tricep pull down. And then the one that I like the most, that gets like a really good contraction, is simply with nothing on it. You just grab it, just hold on, and then just take it all the way back and you can feel the contraction so well on the back end of your tricep. Because obviously you don't want the pull down to be your ultimate movement. You want to do like, you know, overhead tricep pushing and shit. There's other stuff you can do, but point is, all three variations is something you should definitely add to your tricep workouts. Very good, very good. All right, so we're finished at the gym. Good chest and try day. About to head back to Memo's house and play some FIFA. You're massive, dude. We're going over fucking IEDs and shit. <laughs> We're in the streets of Afghanistan. I know, dude. I claim my Everest. Damn, thicker than my. <laughs>